What's going on, Clutch Squad? It's your boy Dub. My guy here. Yeah, you see what's going on. I think we're in the clutch, baby. He kept showing the blood real quick. Showing we're gonna be playing it. Let it drip to the end of it. Yeah. That's what time. But yeah, so we finna watch 10 scary videos not recommended before bedtime. Ooh, so tell y'all, man, we coming with that scary content. Happy Halloween for those that do celebrate. And we finna get into this one right now. I know that's the guy with the voice. Oh, God. His so voice is really the, the true scare. It Jeez. is. Yeah. Yeah, his, his voice is actually scary. Yeah, it's, it's <laughs> annoying. But we finna get into this one right now, man. Run up those like, subscribe, oh, and let's get God. creeped out. You feel me? Let's go. You're bad. Hopefully nothing on this yeah, list. Just, These just 10 scary videos are not recommended before bedtime. Number 10. <laughs> hey, how cave you children at it. play. Submitted to the Chills Narrator subreddit by a sleep ad 8673. Sleep this ad. Redditor wrote, Caution, oh. cave children at play. Let's watch their submission and see what they're talking about. <laughs> nah, I just I'm good on caves, it's man. Kind of little cart or something i don't even know why are you in the cave i like to explore caves boat juice cowboy asked what are we looking for to which the redditor responded saying the random plastic children's boat in the cave water nothing crazy but very off-putting when we realized what we were seeing and shut the front door to followed up asking and what were you seeing exactly totally interested to which the redditor responded saying there was a group of three people that were following us they started throwing rocks or banging on the wall couldn't tell which didn't exactly want to find out <laughs> they seem to be very intoxicated so mm -mm. probably just trying to scare us but you never know seems like it's time to leave that cave I only see this situation going from bad to worse number nine <laughs> Serbian dancing lady <laughs> we've all seen the creepy videos of the Serbian dancing lady no, I've, I've even shared the trend in one of my other videos here's another Hey, yo, nah, bro. Everybody just do the twist. Ooh, up, up, come on, baby. That's what she, that's what she listens just to. Just do the twist. I don't know. Shared by YouTube channel Blah Damn. Blah, this video is trending in the Arabic speaking YouTube community. The original source of the video Just is TikToker Nika Els. I've analyzed a similar clip of hers in a previous video, but this one takes the cake. What you doing in that moment? Like she just turned around and started pointing at you. I'm not even going. I'm not even. You doing the twist? You're like in the middle of the night, nigga. I'm going. <laughs> 10 and 2. I got you. I'm not even. And I'm not even. If I'm happen to be out walking, I'm going to just walk the other way. I'll take the long way before I even go down that street. Yeah. I'm good, bro. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a lot going on. Unless I got some insurance on me. Yeah. But it's like, what would you be need? But she hitting it low key though, like the feet work too. And well, the dancing is all fun and games. The big reveal is nothing short of horror. What's the big reveal? She points at the camera randomly. What's wrong face, with her though. face? And why is she pointing at us? This is a look that will haunt my nightmares. No, be sure won't. to follow her Nika Els on TikTok. Number eight. Entity in Austin in Not April in Austin. of 2023, oh, a dairy farmer outside of Austin, Texas, captured a mysterious entity Too on close. camera. His daughter uploaded the image, asking the internet at large what Whoa. they think it could be. YouTube channel Project Mystery shares the footage with his audience. All right. Are they among us? That's the question. Seems like they are. After the farmer heard some noise outside, he went to check it out. Near the cow pens, he saw this creature. What put him off was the chilling way the creature was walking. Further security footage captured the creature up close. Hell no. The figure has long limbs, enormous black eyes, and appears emaciated. This looks like a clear extraterrestrial capture to me. But what is the extraterrestrial after? 
some cow milk, man. Duh. Right. Trying to see about these burgers. I think if it was about. planning an abduction, we wouldn't be watching this video. Maybe it's just hungry. Number seven, crybaby bridge. There are crybaby bridges scattered across the U.S., all with various legends surrounding them. YouTuber Hauntings with Hodge investigates this one in Delaware. The team pauses as they cross the bridge, and in the distance, you can hear a faint hooting, or is it sobbing? Can we see that? Oh, great. Later, they find odd handprints on the truck of their vehicle. That's me. That's Gabe. That's Gabe. This is the random one we're not sure about. That's a baby hand. They're so close dude. together. Like this one. That's that one looks like it got smeared along. Yeah, but that's a baby hand. Yo, I don't like that, yo. Anyone here? When they stop wait, recording, wait, wait. they hear something. Yeah, I'm here, nigga. Maybe five minutes after that, not even. And then all we hear like tires screeching very faintly, and then out of nowhere, this scream. Well, that's a woman scream too. That just. It was a. Although they didn't capture this mysterious scream on camera, one viewer captures something in the darkness, a soft sob or moan that can be heard right before Kyla speaks. Listen closely. I'm not hearing a lot of stuff. Did you hear it? No. no. I think there really is a crybaby on this crybaby bridge, oh and if the legend is true, her plan is to drown you. Number six, <laughs> Mount Morris Mystery House. That's the goddamn word. Uh, the, the quotes at the end. Uh, his narration is the true horror, y'all. This is why we only check out his vids like during Halloween, bro. That's it. Because <laughs> I, I, there's no way. Because I can't do it. <laughs> The Mount Morris Mystery House has seen a number of investigative teams digging for paranormal activity. The YouTube team Spirit Walk Paranormal is one of them. Upon first entering the home, the team captures an ultra creepy EVP. The voice says, most are young. This leads us to wonder, who? They get money As they continue yeah. to search the place, they find this doll. I mean, you go and touch it. <laughs> <laughs> As I usually happens, touch doll stuff is his business. Hey, yeah, that doll hasn't been touched. Is it possessed? The disembodied voices seem to suggest so. Right here. Here it is again, slowed down. <laughs> They also get a spike on their EMF meter as they come nearer the doll. It, it's a steady milligal spike. Whoa. That's a six. 5.5, 5.7, 6, 1. This is higher than the spike that we got in the attic. And it gets crazier from there. 8.4. <laughs> Seven two. This nigga still holding it. Right, like maybe y'all know the the seriousness of the number going up, but whatever it is, it ain't that dangerous. He just holding it, gripping yeah. it in his hand. Yeah. Unless the hell just get up and jump. <laughs> I'm not. Yeah, come on, bro. While the EMF continues to spike, two chilling disembodied voices are heard, like one after Nokia the other. Mm -hmm. Strange high EMF spikes in the room. A spirit says. And as I move closer to the closet where the doll has been, another spirit warns us by saying, Based on the EMF readings and the I voices heard, so I do down. think this doll right. is possessed. I'm telling you to stop touching shit that ain't yours. That's yeah, what he's doing. For it. Bro, that's my. I still got my, my, my receipt, my ghost receipt. Do y'all think maybe they're not even trying to scare you? Maybe they're just telling you to leave shit alone. That's usually how it be. Put it down. Put it down, bro. Go. I see you. Stop. Put my <laughs> stuff down. <laughs> leave it here. I wanted it there. Leave it here. Jeez, bro. Then yeah, ooh, it's an eight. Yeah, it's an eight, all right. And I think their handling of it has disturbed the demon within. Number five, door slam. Living with poltergeists makes even daily chores interesting. <laughs> YouTuber Courtney <laughs> Remarks shares this footage of a poltergeist and disturbing her going. laundry. Look at her face, like, uh, bro. I would have been gone. 
She too calm for me. Maybe she thought After she the just door makes an unusual move, is that a cross you can right see there Courtney too? pause mm. for a moment before like throwing it. her clothes on the ground in the hallway. I would have threw it right there. And then went downstairs and Courtney probably then turns the and door. retreats down the stairs, checking her phone. My guess is that she's reviewing the security footage to ensure that she's not gone mad. I'll check that when I get outside. Yeah. <clears throat> The door does not swing shut completely. It just slams slightly, seems to hit something, and is knocked back. So what caused it? The angle is unfortunate because we don't see straight on, but judging by Courtney's reaction, it seems unexplainable. I'm guessing she's used to living with poltergeists. <laughs> she's used Number to four, living. What? House of the Inquisition. Now. The Inquisition left a dark history behind. YouTuber Alberto Del Arco visits <laughs> this abandoned house Alberto. of the Inquisition, and what he finds here is haunting. While exploring the derelict home, they spot something in an empty building. We're gonna go to the little tower. Where he what is there? I don't know. I, I can't even tell what that is. I don't, I, I, do I don't see, see what they're seeing. Yeah. It looks like a slight shifting of shadows, but it is not a clear figure. Still, it's enough to scare them all. After feeling your hair stand on end, would you take this investigation Did further? They go to I thought not, and neither would I. Number three, Devil's Cabin. The Devil's Cabin is home to a dark entity. YouTube team Twin Paranormal revisits the place after envisioning something evil on the first go around, and they know exactly where the evil is. Spirit here with us right now. Back door. Back door. Oh, oh my dude. Did you hear that knocking right before that? Yeah. Literally. <gasps> I am a child. How did that just happen? I wasn't even here. The child speaks. <sighs> just. I don't want to be that guy. Yeah. With this kind of stuff, but. <sighs> All right, I'm a child. Sound like an 80 year old smoker. <laughs> Got you. Spirit is there, and it wants in. Can you hear us at all? There, no! No! He is watching you through the window. Oh my! From the back door to the window, the spirit is watching, or maybe it's already found its way inside. We hear you. We hear you. And the activity continues. Yeah, that was something. Do you remember us by any chance? Can you kind of give us a sign, please? They just made a jingle once. <laughs> what? That was a whistle. The entity is inside the house, and I can tell it has only evil on its mind. Number two. Paranormal encounter. Murder, this <laughs> five bedroom bungalow may appear quiet and remote, but paranormal entities are active here. Oh, YouTube word. team Ouija Brothers investigates Ouija the brothers. haunted abode, and before they even enter, they hear strange sounds. We've obviously got Mart back on the channel. It's great to have him with us yet again. And Street yeah, fire. there is. What the was that? What was that? that? was a banshee or something. A banshee. Upon entering, <laughs> they hear even more unsettling noises. Show yourself to them, any of your power or whatever you can do. Is it possible that you could do that very same thing tonight for us three? What? The the fact they be looking a for little answers. later, they hear it again. Do it again, louder. What can you hear it? What? <laughs> this is got a throat goat demon in right. it. Right. Like, what? Nah, y'all better chill because y'all gonna have people pulling up. This is. This... Hey, where the throat goat demon at, man? I'm trying to see something. I'm trying to get spooked too. I'm trying to get spooked. <laughs> <laughs> Throats. Come on, everybody got this same app. 
Yeah, I guess so. It's like a ghost Siri. Yeah. Although I do hear some distinct unexplained banging, I don't hear the chains rattling, but maybe the mics didn't pick it up. Has someone been chained here? I think yes. This place has definitely locked in its dark secrets. Oh I've got a challenge God. for you. Since you've made it this far, why not like this video and hit subscribe in the YT YouTube team, Spire Airfield. I'm at Dylan is chillin yt and tap that follow button to find out number one <laughs> sleep airfield located in the uk sleep airfield is an aviation club but it's not all that it seems the youtube team spire paranormal group shares this strange light anomaly that was captured on a security camera in the museum you can't tell me that's the number one spot right bro that could have been any goddamn thing Although this flash is brief, the team were unable to find any logical explanation for it. They tried to debunk it but couldn't. It wasn't a camera flash. It wasn't a camera flash. Try recreating it, but it just wasn't the same. Not the strobe off a light aircraft. Not a car headlight again, wrong direction, facing the air. Bro. Without a clear idea of what's in the surrounding area, it's for bedtime if I, you need rest then you might want to skip this video i think y'all are gonna sleep well tonight bro yeah yeah i will probably sleep well tonight. i would go to sleep with no issues i'd probably go to sleep watching the video because of his goddamn voice <clears throat> it's just i know that's part of the stick but <laughs> it's so fucking cringe <laughs> Super scary, yeah. <laughs> this is creepy. <laughs> if you guys want more, you know what to do. Make sure you write up the likes. Comment down below. Spread love. Be love. Catch you in the next video. We're out. <laughs> Bitches from Houston If you got a problem then we got the solutions And there's no illusion I made this shit happen, I'm living life lucid I'm switching my strategies Now they hate on me cause I'm causing casualties But why are they after me? Deep inside they know they can't handle half of me